of people stare at us, what we are doing, but we don't care. Uh, they are thinking about the wear ball. No one in India has seen that ball. I'm very proud to play footy. In fact, I'm very lucky that they approached me and told about this game. Because without that, I would have lost in a black hole. It's a very fantastic game. It's a new game in India. So it's a very crazy game, uh, like uh, footy, footy. What is footy? <laughs> I like playing footy. We feel happy because uh, it's, it's like a funny game and it's very <laughs> best game. I think and I dream that I was go to Australia and play there. It is very fantastic game. I like it. One fine day, my, my teammate Zubair, he happened to call me that there's a new sport in town and introduced a new ball to me. And I was like, oh, what the hell is it like, you know? One of my friends was bouncing the ball, the red footy, and I was very keen about that, what is it bouncing? So I went to him, he, he just explained me about what the Australian soul football, and then I got love with the footy, <laughs> and I started playing footy at the local park in our area. Later on, I happened to do a little bit of research on Google, what it is all about. And when I got to know more and more about this particular game, it built more and more interest of mine in this game. Normally, you have people play cricket. So we are playing something different. So we get a different identity over here. Cricket, I feel it's a lazy game. All people are engaged in this game. I don't just play AFL, but I live AFL. I teach AFL, I get a chance to interact with people at the schools, at the colleges, and that's my passion. I, I love to coach kids. We have few kids who are underprivileged, some are from the good family, but really it doesn't matter because we are all together, we are as a family. There's no big, there's no small. Good thing about foot is that it gives opportunity to everyone. They have a dream, they doesn't belong to which part they are, or which religion, or which background, financial problems they are having. They love footy, they come, they play, and they have a dream, the only dream to play for India. We got an opportunity to play against the Australian teams in Kolkata. Because of footy, you get a chance to travel across the country. You spend 40 hours in train. It's a long journey, and that is when you all come in together and you create a good bond, like, you know, you build trust, and that is how you build a team. It's a dream, like, you know, where you wear the Indian jumpers with all the tricolors. You have your saffron, the white, and the green. But I'm really thankful to AFL and God, like, giving me this opportunity to represent my country. It's a dream coming true, wearing an Indian jumper. It's always a dream to be a part of India, represent whatever sport you do. So it was the first ever international match that was ever played in India and I was really proud and I was honoured to participate in that particular match. Honestly, I never thought there would be anyone. I thought it would be one of the remote areas and there would be hardly anyone to watch us. But there were 6,000 people and that, that's a great number. Even the people there, uh, people waiting for us for almost eight hours to have a first international match playing in front of them, so they were ex excited. It was a really good experience, like, you know, I never personally thought that I would ever get a chance to play in front of so many people. You were standing and you were wearing the Indian jumpers. Along with you, have a team on the right, on your left. They are just standing with you. It's like an Indian army standing with you. Uh, when we heard the anthem of India, uh, it feels goosebumps. It feels goosebumps. And I was very excited the moment I heard that, you know, we are going to play against the Masters because that, that was the moment that I always waited for. It was a wonderful experience. You are running on the ground and even if you touch the balls, all the spectators who are watching you, they were like, oh, my person, my, 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 my player is take, taking the ball, kicking the mark. So they were excited. It was a proud moment playing for them. It's a great achievement for everyone. You are among the only 18 who comes from India. It's a wonderful, proud moment. And even the Australian guys, they appreciated us for the game that we played. It was a proud feeling and it was like, you know, I was, I felt like I'm a celebrity. 
the final whistle was done, the game was stopped, and every people running to us, clicking on selfie, they were cheering us, they were handshaking us, they were like hugging us. It was, yeah, you, you guys played well. So though we lost the match, there were smiles on, on people's faces, and we ourselves were proud of the performance that we delivered. And we are a family now, and it was definitely a good thing, like, you know, playing with them and representing your country in India. Australian rules football gave me an opportunity to accept different cultures across the India as well as across the world. It's uh, like connecting the peoples from the various states uh, due to this game. Footy, it has given me like you know a lot of confidence in myself. I was among those people who never used to interact all by myself. But after playing footy, it, it has given me a lot of courage wherein I can face anyone, no matter how huge you are, whether it's on the ground or whether it's outside, no matter what the situation is. Footy makes me happy. Footy teaches me to be a better person. I'm really thankful to, to AFL, to Footy. Like it has, it has taught me a lot of lessons in my life. Footy is a game for everyone, and that is why I love this particular game.